If you're ready to do math today and you have your coffee ready, join me in the simultaneous sip. The question we're working on today is, let A be the matrix negative 6, negative 3, 12, 6, and W be the vector 2, 1. Determine if W is in the null space of A, and then determine if W is in the column space of A. I know this question sounds intimidating because of all the scary words, but really it's just asking us to do some calculations that we've done earlier this semester. For, so for W to be in the null space, we just want to check if A times W gives us the zero vector. And that's really not that hard of a calculation. So we do A times W. In our first row, we get negative 12 plus 12, which is zero. In the next row, we get negative six plus six, which is also zero. So we get zero, zero, which means that W is in the null space of A. To check if W is in the column space of A, again, this is just a, a question that we could have asked weeks ago. This is asking if AX equals W has a solution. And so what we do is we take an augmented matrix that has A and then the last column is W, and we're going to row reduce and see what we get at the end. And here we see we have a row of all zeros at the end. And so AX equals W is consistent, so W is in the column space of A. Make sure to subscribe for more Coffee and Math with Dr. Wesselcouch. Don't text and drive. Bye-bye.